All right. Hi. Welcome in Line by Line. And today we have a special guest, Jack Harris. And, as, and as always, uh, Manuel. Hello. <laughs> Hi. Uh, we are analyzing a, a song <laughs> called Chinchilla uh, from the band This Town Needs Guns. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, Jack, why did you pick that song? Oh, I really resonated with this band. Ooh. Young, young adult, 18, 19, 20, maybe at the end of high school. <laughs> love this band. Love this album. Love this genre of music. It struck me because... After this album, the singer-songwriter actually left the band to start a family. Mm. So, yeah, we've got we've got this. We've got uh, yeah, I I love the uh, the acoustics, the guitar. Well, I know nobody here's probably heard it before. I but, listen to it. It's awesome. Uh, I, no, I everyone, will provide the links below. Actually, but the, the audience they they haven't right. Okay, guys, uh, take your time, check it out. It's it's uh, below in the description. The right. links to the actual song and to the band. Okay. All right, cool. So far, we've lost focus. Let's just concentrate on words that could mean everything. On nights like this, we drink ourselves dry and make promises without intention. So fortunate that this was brought up the last time. As I recall, I can't hold up your every expectation. On nights like this, we drink ourselves dry and make promises without intention. My God, is this what we've become? Living parodies of love and loss. Can we really be all that lost? So fortunate that this was brought up the last time. As I recall, you can't hold up your every expectation. One moment to another, I am restless. Seems making love forever can often risk your heart. And I cannot remember when I was this messed up. In service of another, I am beautiful. But da 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 okay yeah so let, let's get the focus back and uh, oh. start at the start um, so far we've lost focus let's just concentrate on words that could mean everything so jack what does that mean to you Well, two people, it, it seems like um, in, in, the, in the interaction, there is nothing. I mean, nothing really meaningful, you know, dancing around the bush, uh, trying for something, um, but really just attempting to, I mean, just like attempt in the attempt of like, oh, this could mean anything, just, just closing it off, you know, losing focus and not, not purposefully but interactively, um, not getting back on, on focus. That's what that means to me. Yeah, what that reminds me of is uh, getting stoned with my friends in the park. Mm. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> right? Like, you're like, ooh, and then. We start talking and everybody's like really 
amazed, right? It's like like intrigued, that's the word, by, by what's going on. Um, and if you'd record it, right, and play it back, it's, it's just silly, silly things. But, but everybody's like thinking that it's really, really profound what's happening in the moment. Uh, and, and, and there is there is a level of concentration that, that's happening while being stoned, right? Like, so, so you, you lost the focus in, in the sense that, that it's all floaty and going on, but, but there's still the concentration. It's like, because you're captured by it. But captured by whatever you're talking about. Whatever, whatever you're talking about. And is that. Yeah. I mean, what you're talking about is it is it true or real? It's profound. Or it, it is profound. It is meaningful to you. I interpret it as not being profound. Like well, well but in the moment it is. <laughs> I I interpret it as like dancing around the bush like like we've got something that we should be focusing on uh, in the relationship, but I guess I guess it could mean that too. But we're not. We're just saying empty things to just kind of keep it trudging along. Mm. But that that's that's another good perspective too. Uh, I I think that it. Uh... That he tries to center her in a sense because they talk about small things like dishes and stuff and he he said like okay let's 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 remove all this small talk and uh talk about something that could mean everything or nothing like, like let's just focus on that like he tries to get some answers at this moment because he sees that the relationship doesn't go anywhere Oh, I see. Whoa. Oh, so that's like the, the attempt to get some answers. Wow. Well, what it also could mean is, is that there's double step speak, right? So you're saying one thing, but, but you're implying something else, but, but nobody's ever grounding that plane right so, so you, you you're effectively have, having this teasing element in, in the conversation but but nobody knows whether it's it it's meant or whether it's play mm -hmm. oh. wow Wow. <laughs> okay, I, I just, I no, just man, removed that forward. I love, I love how Manuel is just like focused on like the play aspect of, of <laughs> this line means. I, I like, like, I like no, how no Jack. Play. You lost focus. Can't lose focus. <laughs> I, I, I love how you're, you're, you're exactly embodying how I was when I was stoned. It's like, Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> sometimes, sometimes it'd be like that. You know? on, <laughs> on nights like this, we drink ourselves dry and make promises without intention. Yeah, Jack, what, what's that smile about? No, it's just like at, at that moment, I, I understood what the profound, like profoundness in, but when you play it back, it's just so stupid. But then it hits you and you're like, oh. <laughs> wow. I just got it. I embodied. I literally, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, See, this, yeah, is, so this is, oh, you, uh, oh, this, this is where, this is where, uh, I really think they're just, they're not even, they're like avoiding the answers. 
uh, just, you know, drinking ourselves dry, right? Uh, it's something to do. Uh, you know, make promises without intention. So, oh, saying, you know, alcohol flows and say, hey, I'm going to do this, but you're never going to do it. I think it brings it up it to, to the previous line. Uh, it's like, let's let's focus on words that could mean everything. It's actually promises without intentions. So they, they will be like, like I, I imagine this, this thing where he's like, this is the night where we do it again. <laughs> Drinking, but focusing on uh, promises without intentions. Perhaps oh, it's just geez. like describing this one evening. Because words that could mean any everything also could mean promises without intentions, but might be, let's say. Well, let's go skinny dipping. <laughs> uh, those don't mean everything, though. Like skinny dipping is a thing that, that you do for a short time, but like it, it doesn't mean. Yeah, well, if you had like if you had all fifty six genders, that would be. <laughs> yeah. Uh, whatever number there is currently. So uh, I think promises, uh, but words that could mean everything would be, let's change this planet, promise, let's stop this war, promise, and stuff like that. Like, yeah. Promises. If everybody <laughs> smoked weed, there'd be no war. <laughs> <laughs> That's a promise. Yeah. yeah. But, but yeah, like I, I still imagine like laying there stoned because like I'm just ignoring the drinking and it's like, let's go skinny dipping and everybody's like, yeah, <laughs> let's do it, right? And then and half an hour later, weren't we supposed to do something? <laughs> yeah, oh, line by man. line, for example. Uh, <laughs> no. So, so uh, I'm, I'm unfamiliar with drinking yourself dry. Like, is, is there any special meaning to drinking dry? You drink yourself dry. Uh, I do have uh, an idea, but it's uh, it's not what you guys think. They, they have the saying for like a hangover, you know, three sheets to the wind. You, know, you wake up. No, they said ourselves. Dry. We drink ourselves dry. Okay. Yeah, so you're blowing, you're blowing yourself dry. No, it's like you bleed yourself <laughs> dry, but then you drink <laughs> yourself dry. Wait, oh, you drink? <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, like you, you drink? No, yourself. I mean, I mean, like the wind, like how the wind blows. <laughs> I don't mean, I mean, like, I don't, I mean, like air. On well, night like, like this. Dry. You know, we blows. drink ourselves dry like it's like it's the same as bleed yourselves dry but like I, oh. I, i'm not an english speaker but that's how i understood like drinking yourself dry because it's, it's like it's like like on that like this we all become vampires <laughs> bleed ourselves dry. it's a horrible yeah. i will i will probably cut it out i will see how funny it is <laughs> later on uh, but uh, yeah I don't know, man. Lights like this. Uh, I don't know what kind of nights these guys are having. But <laughs> Fun? It doesn't sound good according to our analysis. <laughs> They're like playing Monopoly or something. Yeah. Crazy. Well, I, I, I just think because we have three different things where they're like trying to find answers. But I mean, clearly they're failing. And I think they're just avoiding the answers entirely. There's something, there's some, there's some elephant in the room or some dragon, you know, that, that's, that's growing. Mm -hmm. And they're just like, you know. <laughs> need, need more alcohol. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> more liquor. <laughs> Let's just drink, <laughs> okay. Okay, by the way, guys, disclaimer, wheat and alcohol is a very bad combination. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't know where wheat came from. For me, that, that that that's my sin. And guys, if you do weed and alcohol, go easy. I will cut it out. <laughs> oh, there will be again an episode with so much I just <laughs> so fortunate <laughs> that this was brought up <laughs> the last time. 
as I recall, <laughs> can't hold up your every expectation. So it was brought up. W wild drunk, I suppose. The promises. That working time, I think. Well, yeah, or the thing that was drunk dry. Oh, the promises Ourselves? were. Ourselves? So, so I get the sense that they're in a loop, right? So they're going out and it's like... This is like, a loop. The, the, the hundredth evening that they're going out, right? And and it's like, oh yeah, <laughs> we're making these promises, and we all know, like, we made them like fifty times before, <laughs> and yeah. like, we all know that it's never gonna happen. And oh no, so sad. Oh, I just understood what the line "drinking ourselves dry" and promises without intention. So the moment they drank too much and all the bottles were over, they mm. made promises not to drink again. <laughs> okay. Oh, you the world. That was so bad. Oh, that that <laughs> seems oddly correct. <laughs> I nailed it. <laughs> As I recall, I can't hold hold up your every expectation. It's like, okay, I'm just oh, gonna they're... bring <laughs> more beer next time. <laughs> they're drinking buddies. Yeah. Uh, are they drinking buddies? Oh no. This seems wow. No drink. Okay. No, I think it's it's like that. So so uh, again, the story continues. They promised each other not to drink anymore, and he's like, "Now uh, I'm so fortunate. This was brought up uh, the last time, as I recall, and I can <laughs> hold up." Uh, to your every expectation, <laughs> there is new six pack here. <laughs> like this it's, such a, <laughs> it's such an alcohol thing to say. It, it's, it's like, <laughs> I'm so slammed, I should never get drunk again. Right. Like, how many times have you heard that? Right? Ironically, like, so... ironically, we are all super sober and not stoned at all. <laughs> no. Okay. We meditated. <laughs> we meditated yes. Well, maybe maybe only one person is drunk. Iron root? <laughs> I, no, he's high. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's like meditation gets you high, you see? Like if you do it properly in awakening. <laughs> My God. Is this what we've become? become? Living parodies of love and loss can we really be all that lost see now now i'm thinking now i'm thinking it's just the guy's an alcoholic and he's just projecting this onto his onto his partner yeah <laughs> like i think they're both alcoholics <laughs> yeah like like why are you protecting one person <laughs> yeah like like because he he's like is this what we have become because they're both drinking your, themselves dry, living parodies of love and loss. What are they Can, the, like? So fortunate this was brought up the last time. As I recall, I can't hold up your every expectation. Mm -hmm. but, oh, that could mean a lot of things. No, the problem is not to drink again, for example. <laughs> no, just, the way of words that could mean everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's the song, <laughs> is that you know? what we're like, doing? That's <laughs> literally the song. Yeah, the name of the song is Chinchilla. <laughs> so, super random. Chinchilla. Yes. Uh, so basically, it could mean everything. No, that's the brand of beer that they drink. There is no beer named Chinchilla. <laughs> I, I don't know what's from. Like, I, I am just we, sure. Like, Chinchilla, would... we want a sponsorship. Yeah. Thank you. It's from <laughs> Chinchilla. Bro. Yeah, like, can you imagine uh, drink drink ourselves dry on Chinchilla? <laughs> <laughs> chinchilla like, like, makes you chill. Like, like, it makes okay. it chill. <laughs> chilchilla? Oh, chilchilla is an honest, like a really good name for beer. Chilchilla. Uh, chinchilla, yeah. <laughs> no, not even chinchilla. Chilchilla. 
Oh. Chill, chill. <laughs> yeah. Chill, yeah. chill. Chill, chill. Well, chill. I, I think, I think it's a chill, better chill. name for weed, actually. <laughs> <laughs> that's a new that's a new thing yeah by the way iron root is or manuel is in uh, netherlands where weed is super legal so you can get it anywhere yeah i'm in california yeah okay super legal here in my country it's weed just is really expensive <laughs> oh it's super illegal in poland oh super illegal oh. like uh, very legal so i'm just like oh, watching wow two of you talk about uh, this new weed brand named Chill Chilla. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're going <laughs> <start, laughs> to start a company, right, Jack? Like, yeah, named name Chill Chilla, yeah. <laughs> we're we're also going to sell Chihuahuas. <laughs> They're called <laughs> Chill Chilla. Yeah. We're going to sell chinchillas and chihuahuas exclusively. Yeah. No, I, I will get a chinchilla and name it Chill Chilla. Only Latin American rodents. So, <laughs> and, and then we have chilla, the, chihuahuas. The, is chihuahua Big brownies I called, chi called chilla. Called <laughs> well, chihu chihuahuas were bred in Mexico for eating. They were like, aren't they dogs? Yeah, but they're bred <laughs> as like eating eating dogs. Like you eat them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So far, we <laughs> must focus. <laughs> That's what the tribes in Mexico. Like this, this song is literally a self-fulfilling prophecy. Yeah. <laughs> and we <laughs> analyze it about properly, <laughs> by the way. We get into spirit of the song, we channeled it. <laughs> Guys, like, look into my eyes, we channeled is it. Is this a oh, good spirit to channel? It's awesome. <laughs> this, this is the spirit I channeled when I was stoned. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So, so let, 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 my God, is this what, this what we've become? <laughs> My God, so fortunate. And the God is like, don't mention me in Wayne. Just just talk to Zeus. He's just over there under your blanket. That's a thing, Jack, we are doing where Manuel, Manuel jails his Zeus under blanket. Uh, otherwise... Jails? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, otherwise... else he's going to go around raping women. Like, <laughs> Whoa! Oh, oh, Zeus. No, yeah, Zeus. Zeus, Zeus is like, it's his Think, like he cannot keep it that's why he's under his but, but he's a god right he's immortal so like all i can do is keep him chained up like i'm, yeah. I'm, I'm gi giving a big service to humanity keep him chained up yeah <laughs> yeah it's like super not creepy <laughs> you can't keep a god chained up what are you talking about okay god is uh, like zeus is actually absolutely consenting to that behavior <laughs> so i i just want to say this is the first <laughs> like <laughs> We're embodying the song in line by line, like it's it's actually happening, people. <laughs> it's called projections. Real Final time. participation. <laughs> Projection. So yeah, like, so I, I I think they're just literally in a state like this, and they're like, "Holy cow! Like, is this what we're doing with our lives? Like, oh, we're we're living parodies of love and loss." Um, I don't know. I just think that the guy who's writing the song is an alcoholic, brought the other person into it, and then kind of, you know, he gets drunk, they get drunk, and then the cycle just continues. Right? Yeah, then they're both alcoholics. <laughs> yeah, they're, like, they're both alcoholics, but I think I think the person that he's writing to is very dependent on him because they're like like so fortunate that this was brought up the last time. As I recall, I can't hold up your every expectation. You know, it's like they depend on them. Like a very dependent person is on him. And he's just an alcoholic and then he's drinking. And then they start drinking. They're like, stop drinking. And they just keep on drinking. It's like, you're an alcoholic. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> guys like, ah. <laughs> so, so what is a living parody of love and lust? Like, how do we conceive of that? It's not living to the ideal. It's mm. uh, it's like uh, it's a mockery of the ideal. Like the person comes out, uh, like crawls out of bed, and then he's like, "Let me pretend I will act like a person who is in a relationship." And then he's like, "Come here, give me a kiss." And then he goes and like he 
like then he's like yeah i'm a parody so sir like i i get the sense of an empty shell and, and and this guy going out for his girlfriend like at two two in the in, at night mm -hmm. getting a new six pack like that's the love <laughs> <laughs> Aww. And, and and the loss is about their jobs. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All the yeah, savings yeah. were were spent yeah. on another six pack. Yes, Aww. look at my six pack. Oh. Sheila died. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> it's a meditation six pack, baby. Yeah. <laughs> when you meditate, you have to sit up. <laughs> when you meditate. In the correct posture, yeah. <laughs> With your hands like this, you'll get a six pack. With your hands like this. <laughs> your hands like this is the six pack hand pose. Yeah. That's a parody of love. <laughs> <laughs> losing my fat. Can mean. we really be all that lost? So, so that's denial, right? It's like, oh my god, is is this real? <laughs> I know it's very pathetic. Um, is this real? Because ah, the guy's like, ah. he's just like, you know, he's like, ah. like, woe is me. Like, like just, ah, poor me. I'm an alcoholic. Okay. Uh, my God. Is this <laughs> what he have become? Living parodies of love and loss. Can we really be all that lost? Yeah, uh, I think uh, he he sobered up after running out of alcohol, and uh, he kind of looked back on 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 the evenings, and then he remembered like, oh, I promised myself not to do that last time, and then my God, is this what he, we have become? <laughs> And then, and so then she's she's, she's like uh, over there, and he's like, "Oh my God, we are living paradise! Like you are not even, yeah." So yeah, I think that's my summary yeah, of the song. Paradise, oh, love and <laughs> he's trying to be all poetic to get her back, you know. <laughs> We're living parodies of love and loss. <laughs> <laughs> baby come back Please. baby you're so hopeless that you have to stay with me <laughs> baby stop being a parody come with me and be the real thing that's beautiful actually, <laughs> actually beautiful I actually like it <laughs> okay uh, should we move on or should we yeah let's move on okay. one moment to another I am restless seems making love forever can often risk your heart. Yeah. So uh, mm -hmm. maybe he's trying to kick the booze, and he's just like, "Oh my god! Like I'm, I'm, I'm so stressed. <laughs> I'm restless. <laughs> please, please give me some new beer." He's orienting to the wrong thing, though. He's like. <laughs> Making love for everything, that's disgusting. <laughs> it's gross. That's like Dante's Inferno stuff, dude. That's what not yeah. I read. Oh. Like, I think I, he gets those moments where he's super restless and whatever moment they do, he wants to continue uh, for a long time. But she's like, my heart, oh my God, I will get a heart attack. Please stop in making love forever. <laughs> wait, can, wait, wait. My heart. Oh, she's saying my heart. My heart. <sighs> yes, yes. Ah. Oh, That's why cool. like, he, he, he gets so <laughs> restless. He just, want, he just wants to like make he, love he, forever. Yeah, that she's like, oh my god, I will get a heart attack. Please stop making it forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. Can often risk your heart. You're like, oh, can often risk your heart, not my That's heart. How I, your heart. <laughs> That's how I read it. If I if if I make love to you, your heart will be forever bound to me, and if you go away, you will have a heart attack. You cried Zeus under blanket. He gets drunk. He's like, this is what makes you weak. Oh man. Um, so yeah, on a, on a more serious note. <laughs> <laughs> well, we weren't being serious. Oh. Um, 
Yes. Yeah, so, so I I think I think this is having mode love. Uh, this is a, a love where <laughs> well, we, we're trying to get laid. <laughs> You're making love forever, yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Red Wells making love. <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> okay, what? Yeah, I don't know. Like, it seems like another addiction. Making love forever. Like, it, it, it has to be another addiction. He's making love forever. What? Because what? <laughs> he's like, you know, you want to be a parody of love and loss, or do you want to make love forever? Maybe, come back. <laughs> You can only have true love if you do it all the time. <laughs> you can only have true love if we make it forever together. Oh my God, that poor girl. <laughs> yeah, dude, this guy, this is what I'm saying. This guy's an abusive alcoholic. <laughs> this, that's what I'm saying. But she's, hey Zeus, she's, did, she's a, did you escape while I didn't pay attention? Like what? <laughs> did you write this long? Codependent. <laughs> mm -hmm. She's a total codependent. That's what I think. She's just okay he wakes up and he's like <clears throat> uh, is there beer no let's make love <laughs> <laughs> one moment to another i am restless yeah <laughs> where's my distraction <clears throat> pussy <laughs> <laughs> and i cannot remember when it was this messed up <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> He's like, so, 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 wasn't he? Wasn't he saying effectively? They're doing it like every night, but but he cannot where remember you what he was. This information. No, he said it right. Like, so fortunate where? that it was brought up not last time. And, and this is also like, can you under that, nine? <laughs> like, I think that's like a grievance that she has. You drink too much. Oh, you treat me like an object. Blah 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 blah. My yeah. heart cannot take it. <laughs> My heart cannot take it. He's like, can we really be all that lost, baby? You pounded me so hard. I cannot remember when I was this messed up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, the, the guy, she's not saying that. I don't think. Oh. Oh. I think this episode has to be above 18. <laughs> These poor, broken people. Uh, yeah. So, uh, I cried a little. <laughs> That's... Oh. <laughs> Just a little, honey. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's what happens when you make love forever, you know. It's, it's so romantic. <laughs> you, you're always on the verge of crying, but you never quite get there. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> like, you want to cry, but you're just making too much love. That, that's why it's risky. You're hard if you make love forever. <laughs> <I'm> like... <laughs> I'm, I'm literally tearing up. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Any Here we go. L last line. In service of another, I am beautiful. Oh, now he's a narcissist. He's like, <laughs> he's like I'm serving you. He's like, I can't. I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm making love to you all night and it's my like, service to you <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I dressed up I'm so beautiful look at me I think, I think he's saying I could do love to you forever as you wow. ask me but I, I could risk your heart so in service of another I'm beautiful yeah it might so, mean that <laughs> I don't know. Like, I really like that line. Like, that line would have been amazing if it wasn't in this song. <laughs> Which one? Is service of another I'm beautiful? Yes, because I, I think that's true. That, that true beauty is revealed in service to another. 
oh, that's how you understand this line. Okay. He becomes beautiful when he service, services another. I thought he threatens her to, to go and serve another woman. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> when I, when I oh. am threatening to leave you, I gain another level of beauty. He's what like, have he's like, so bad. He has, he, he's like telling stuff. her, I would, I, would, I would make love to you forever. Uh, but I would read your heart, so I will <clears throat> go and serve another because then I will be beautiful. I, I don't know. That's how my woman brain made this connection. So, okay, sorry. so he, so he's like, I, oh, I cannot remember when I was this messed up. So what he's doing is he's like taking his inner messed upness and he's projecting it onto his girlfriend, and he's making her crazy and messed up. This is bye. Well, what? she's she's probably crazy. I messed up because she's with him. But okay. <laughs> this guy's this guy's terrible. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I, I think the guy just like had two weekends of drinking and and <laughs> week. <laughs> he just drank twice. <laughs> He's uh. just like <laughs> run out of booze. Then he wanted to distract himself, as you very correctly pointed out, and and then he's like, ah, but I could risk your heart because he probably has a girlfriend with a heart attack issues. <laughs> so, so Jack, I have a question. Like, then he's that. sacrificing himself uh, by, by, by not doing it and it's like, I'm serving you, that's why I'm beautiful. Somehow. Oh, wow. ah, I think I really don't understand this song for some reason. <laughs> it's, 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 <laughs> we're concentrating on words that could have every meaning. <laughs> <laughs> like chinchilla, for example. Like in chinchilla. Uh, so, so I, I want to know, Jack. Like, do, do you think that our analysis of the song uh, was like similar that what you thought the song meant when you picked it? Towards the end, yeah, about the bad relationship, but then. I mean, this could have, like, Manuel in the beginning, you know, this could have meaning for, like, a group of friends, you know? <laughs> even, even, even uh, yeah, or a group of friends, or, because um, I thought it was a couple, like, avoiding the answers, you know? Like, there's answers there, but you're just, they're just distracting themselves, avoiding it entirely. Imagine and it's literally he's singing to Chinchilla. That, he, that he's his girlfriend. <laughs> like, <laughs> like whatever answers, just 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 Chinchilla is uh, not answering him, but he's like uh, talking to it, like he drank himself so much, and then he's talking to his Chinchilla. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 even worse, right? Like he's he's at home and he's like in his underwear, and then he so he smokes himself like completely stoned. <laughs> and then he, go, he, he goes up to, to, to the drinking bowl of the chinchilla. He drinks it completely dry. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> and he makes a promise, I will never do it again without intending to never do it again. And then he's like talking to Chinchilla via parodies of love and loss. A guy talking to his Chinchilla who has an empty Chinchilla bottle or something. Oh my god. He's like, oh Chinchilla, I, I love you so much. And he doesn't. And the Chinchilla he drank is, all its water. Is my water. <laughs> the Chinchillas have weak heart. <laughs> yeah, they, they're inbred. <laughs> they're, they're inbred? Oh. Well, we're gonna sell them, Jack. Like, you have to know when, when you're gonna sell them. Like, you, you can't be oblivious to these creatures. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know. Uh, like, and, and then he's like, uh, he's like talking to Chinchilla. I would love you, Chinchilla, but uh, it would break your heart. But then he said, like, I'm so messed up, dude, but I'm so beautiful. <laughs> like, it's like, it's like, yeah, it's a, it's a super drunk high song. <laughs> so, so, in service of another, is he's like, Oh, 
You need water. Wait, let me get you some water. I can finally show you. He's like, I'm beautiful. <laughs> and then, and then he, yeah, he walks past the mirror and he, he looks in the mirror and he's like, I'm beautiful. And then he completely forgets to get the water. <laughs> okay. Wow. Uh, yeah. Uh, we have analyzed this song. Uh, guys, write out in comments if you have understood this song differently. We appreciate it. And um, as always, we are sponsored by Free Time. And get you some. Free Thank Time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Thank oh. you, Jack. Uh, thank you, Manuel. <laughs> Uh, I will provide links on how to uh, stalk those guys underneath this channel. Uh, okay, I will provide links on how to find those guys in the virtual realm underneath this video. Yes, virtually. If you have enjoyed this podcast, virtual okay, realm. please follow uh, them on whatever links they provide and well, if you want to meet up, I live in the Los Angeles area. Thank you. Hope you have a great day. Namaste. Bye. <laughs>